Hello guys, vlogging with Gibster back here for another video and drawing tutorial. So there's a bit of recording mess up and I've already started to draw the new event, Valentine's Fan Club from Looming Legacy. So you just want to get this for the overall shape of the nose. Uh, probably not too round. I'm going to actually close the snout in a bit. This is the start of it. Right, so this is the reference picture, that is what Valentine's Fan Club looks like. So next thing we're going to do is, after I fix the snout, we're going to do the rest of the head. So we're going to start the sides, bottom sides of the snout. And do a sort of round oval like shape. Like that. Then you're gonna start off with the ears. Now, just give me a second to fix this. You're gonna start with the ears. You're gonna start at the sides and spring out, then round off the sides. It was rounded for the ears, but smaller than that. And the insides of the ears are just half circles, the inner part of the ear. And you're just going to do the same thing on the other side. Now that the ears are done, to finish off the head, you're going to do the eyes. So the eyes are fairly similar to the normal fan club eyes, except some colour differences. Um, so the first thing you're going to do is do two ovals. But the top of them are a bit slanted. As if he's angry. I don't know if he is angry or not. Then you're going to do a complete oval inside those ovals with the slant on top. Now I'm just going to do the eye on the other side. Then, you're going to do a plus sign inside the eyes, and that's the pupils. I'm just going to fix up the eye. Right, okay. Now that you've 
done the head I'm gonna do the rest of the body so the first step is um, actually not a part of the body um, but you're gonna start from like this here where I've done that point there you're gonna go down now there's not actually a line there this is just so that you can pinpoint the exact location and you're going to do a heart shape on the side here because the Valentine's fan club is holding a heart now its evolution isn't out yet uh, so it's not like we know it's a completely new lumion or if it's a um, or if it's going to be a variant of, fat, of uh, your soul, it's probably going to be released next week in part two of the update. Because this is only part one. So, like that. And then what you're going to do, is you're going to go up like that. And basically make it look 3D. like that and then you're gonna do the arm on this side but first you're just gonna do a little line there connecting it and then you're gonna do the arm which is gonna start off straight and then round off with a little paw then you're just gonna do a curved line into the heart to show uh, the, where the stitching is, because of course this is a teddy bear, not a normal bear. And then, um, and then next, what you want to do is you want to start from near the bottom of the heart, and you're going to. You're going to do a leg, a line there for the leg. So I'm fixing up a few things. There you go, yeah. And then uh, you're going to do... It looks almost flat, but you're going to do a very slightly curved line and then straight back up. And then that same slightly curved line, uh, not as big as I did it, uh, for the in between part of the legs. Then you're gonna do you're gonna do a line there and a line there, just to show where you're gonna mark off the pattern. You're gonna start there. You're gonna do a big curve up, and that's the pattern on the foot. And you're gonna do curved line up like that and a straight line down for the leg then you're gonna move up from that curved line you did to split the legs in between you're gonna do a curved line from the bottom of the leg and you're gonna do a straight line up to that up to where you put the dot and then you're gonna do the exact same pattern on the other foot then you're gonna start here from the heart you're gonna do just a little line there right. and then what you're gonna do just you're gonna do I'm just looking at a closer picture of it because I have it in game and I thought I'd just 
have a closer look at it. There's actually balls at the end of the plus on uh, for the pupils. You do balls at the end of them. Uh, and then next what you're going to do is you're going to, from the bottom of the snout, you're going to do a line. Uh, not a line, a curve. Then you're going to do two lines that will connect to the one behind here. And then another two for another ribbon that's hidden behind the heart. Then you're going to do a line down and a line across. That's for one side of the bow. The side that's covered by the heart. And then the other side is a complete round circle. And then I'm going to do a curved line up, but not it's not completely curved. And you're going to do a line there for where the part of the uh, the other part of the arm is. And then you're going to do a line for the piece of ribbon that's holding the bow. You're going to do the same thing on the other side. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go in between the bow and we're going to do a sort of a stomach pattern. Right there, those lines there. No, that's going to be a stomach pattern that I'm going to draw a line here into the bow. for the stomach and I'm gonna do stitch lines because fan cubs all stitchy because he's a teddy bear and there and unlike the normal fan cub there's only two stitch lines on this and then you're gonna do the other arm Which is going to be the same as the other, except the heart isn't covering most of the arm. So you do the curved line from the neck into a straight line, into a curved line for the paw again, rounding into the side of the chest. And then, of course, the coloration. No, not the coloration, that's going to be part two. Uh, then, the pattern for the paw. And that is how to draw Valentine's Fan Cup. Stay tuned for part two where I teach you how to colour it. I think. Or if you want, naturally you know what, never mind. If you want to colour it in, here it is right here. That's the coloration for it. Just pause the video on here and you can colour it. The it, most of its body is a light brown, then it has cyan eyes, it has a red heart, and no, it seems like the ribbon's red, it actually isn't. So the ribbon is actually a sort of, it's an orange colour. So yeah guys, that's been this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.